guys um you are highly welcome to my channel once again today real quick guys um today i am going to share with you guys another powerful way whereby um you guys are going to use to uh, trade any of the pairs out there and especially today uh, for the sake of this video we are going to use uh, gbp uh, usd as an example all right so um you can actually do this with any other pairs out there so what you just need to do right now is for you to um, sit back relax and listen carefully why i explain how to use these tools properly and how you can analyze your chart properly to start making free cash after watching this video so with that being said guys um let's dive into the video all right guys um now as you can see from from my chart here um I am going to analyze this particular chart that you are seeing right now. I believe you can see my chart properly. Um, I am going to analyze this chart and I show you how you can start, you know, analyzing your chart and how you can start placing trade from um, what you analyze and where exactly you're supposed to, you know, um, start uh, analyzing your chart. All right. So I normally say this. Um, if you want to start analyzing your chart, the minimum uh, time frame that you are going to use to analyze your chart should be at least daily um, time frame. All right. So when you analyze your chart on daily time frame, and you um you'll be able to see the clear picture of you know um the particular pair that you are planning to trade on that particular day. All right. So um what you just need to do right now is. As I said earlier on, just pay very close attention while I walk you through how to analyze your chart and the necessary tools that you really need to start making real cash after watching this video. So that is it, guys. With that being said, guys, um, if this is your first time of hearing my voice or if this is your first time of listening to the sound of my voice, let me officially introduce myself. My name is Oli Tess from the home of all co good content, guys. All right. Um, this is absolutely um home for all good content all right so whatever good or whatever um, strategy good content or name it that you really want to succeed in trading forex you will definitely get it here on this channel and uh, i am back for good guys and i am going to be feeding you guys with what really really matters all right so um i've been away for some long now for some time now because i'm trying or i'm working on something so i am fully back on my channel right now and uh, i want every one of you if you have not um subscribed to this channel i want you to do me that favor and smash that subscribe button turn on the notification bell so that whenever i upload content like this guys you will be able to um receive the notification that i've uploaded another powerful content that will assist you in um trading forex and making real cash all right so that is it guys so with that being said let's dive into the video let me share with you guys what i really have for you guys today so this is daily time frame guys as you can see here this is daily time frame and uh, this is a gbp usd here all right so um now what you really need to be doing in any pair that you really want to be uh, trading on should be first in first should be um analysis all right you analyze that particular pair that you want to be uh, or you want to trade you make sure you analyze it at least starting from daily time frame or four hour time frame guys all right this is very very necessary this is very very important for every newbie or any professional out there that does not know what he or she is doing this is the best way for you to go about it so that you will start making real cash most of you come into this um into this feed in the um sense that you want to start making real cash but on the process you are you are giving back your money your hard earned money back to the market instead of making the real cash so now many of the um strategies or many of the teachings that are used are normally sees out there most of them are just saying what they feel like they want to say all right they are not detailing it the way whereby um anybody can understand what they are saying and be able to implement it and start making real money so what i'm going to do here is this i am going to share with you guys how you can start analyzing your chart and start making real cash after watching this 
all right so what you just need to do whatever time frame that you feel like you want to be trading on first thing first like as this particular one the case of this recording i'm using daily time frame here and then um, the first thing that you need to do is you go to this year our uh, tools bar you select your trend line all right so i love drawing trend lines on my charts all right because that is the secret that many people are not telling you all right that is the secret that many people are not telling you so first thing first you need to mark all the important zones all right all the important zones that you are seeing here all these rejection that you are seeing here they are all important zones that you really need to mark out so that you will know why the market reversed at that particular zone and uh, by so doing you'll be able to um, really grab the necessary um key points that you really need and you will know definitely where you're going to open your position with this all right it does not mean that you are going to just mark all these things on daily time frame and just jump into the chart and start trading you need to mark it on daily time frame bring it down that is break your chart down to the minimum all right once you break your chart down to the minimum you will be able to spot exactly things like this as well on the lower time frame as far as you have um you know cross check the market on the higher time frame and you see the direction of the market let's just say for instance that um we are analyzing this particular pair right now now let me use these two here let's follow something like this i want you guys to just follow up and see uh, what i am trying to um you know show you guys all right so probably if you we are here if you we are this particular zone here and uh, you drew um your support and your resistance this way the only thing that will help you know if this market is going to drop again or not should be a trend line guys all right it should be a trend line you go come to this place you pick your trend line from this zone now guys you draw your trend line all right make sure you connect all the whole necessary points here as you can see from this zone i connected to all the necessary uh, points all the necessary zone that i really need to all right so what is this thing signifying all right so as soon as um this market gets to this place and uh, it fails to break this resistance zone and it breaks instead of breaking this resistance zone it retested on it and start coming back down it does not really mean that it's coming to this zone again all right because this is higher time frame though when you break it down to the lower time frame you might probably see that this is coming down to this zone but not immediately all right so what i want you guys to make sure that you start using as soon as you can is this um trend line all right when you use trend line use uh, all the necessary tools support and resistance that is is the key that many people are not talking about and that is the reason most of you are getting your account blown all right because um they will just uh configure indicators and strategies and give to you guys and you go there start using it on your real account before you know it you go against you because you don't know the particular mindset behind that particular strategy so what i'm telling you why i'm saying all these things is this when you are done analyzing your chart on naked um you know chart like this when you are done analyzing on naked naked chart this way what this will only do for you is this when you apply any indicator or when you install any indicator on this chart it will be able to help you detect some places some zones like these ones that we marked all right now had it been um we marked this thing before this market get to this zone all right now for for us to understand why this movement happened here if we add indicators let me um add this indicator and uh, this one here now you will see what i was saying all right when this market happened from this zone to this zone you see that the help of indicator based on we have analyzed this chart without any indicator or without any strategy now this indicator these two indicators that i uh, installed on this app in on this chart right now indicated that this market is going up here all right now with this trend line here with this trend line 
you will see that as soon as the market breaks this trend line guys there is something that you need to do those things that you need to do is for you to watch out if the first candle that breaks that trend line or closes below that trend line and another candle forms below that trend line and the uh, retest on that trend line and the closure of that particular second one is not equal to this guys just be sure and be aware that the market is about to change direction all right so that is what many people are not telling you okay let's just um play a replay on this particular chart here so that you will understand what i'm saying with this analysis that i've done here i am going to cut this particular um chart somewhere here all right so that um we will see if this kind of analysis do work or not all right so let's go okay this is it here i am going to um cut this chart here all right yes um that is it all right that is it we have um disconnected the chart from this zone here so we are going to play the chart to know if this particular um type of um strategy or this particular type of trend line and the uh, key points that i'm talking about is going to work on this all right so let's see that guys and when you look at this all right if i should draw this extend this all right if i should extend this guys you will see that this particular um extension here now we don't really know this is the exact place that the market is right now all right this is the current uh, place that the market is so what you just need to do is since this has broken this uh, support that is to say is a downtrend so you have to look back all right you have to look back to find the zone that this market is heading to as far this thing has been broken all right this support has been broken so you have to look backward to see where or the level that the market will be uh, resting next all right so let's look for that you can see this zone here you can see here you can see what is happening this is the current um place that the market is now so you can see this you see what is going on here you see this so one way or the other this market will be coming to somewhere here all right let's use um a trend line to mark this let's use this horizontal line to mark this this is a vital um zone this is another vital zone here this is another vital zone here so now don't forget where the current price is now this is another vital zone here all these places that i am marking all these places that are marking it means that something serious happened at that particular zone that is why the market reversed or reacted at that zone all these places you can see rejection 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 the market moved back up all right so let's see if using trend line to trade is profitable or not guys all right so now i am going to play this all right i am going to play this to let you guys know that what i'm saying is very very accurate and um mind you all these things that we are talking about here you just have to after analyzing on daily time frame you have to move down to four hour time frame from four hour time frame you have to pick um the vital zones as well and mark it out also you move to one hour time frame you mark out the vital zones and then when you go to the any of the time frame that you get to make sure you mark out the vital zones and once you don't mark out the vital zones what we what that will help you to do is you will know exactly where to open your position you will know exactly where to um spot something like this all right so because as soon as you spot something like this as soon as you spot something like this the next thing that you are going to do is to open your position here and uh, this zone here will be your next tp all right just do not be greedy make sure you follow all these instructions properly and uh, let's just play this thing so that we will know if what we are saying is free or not all right so in case if this thing bounces on this place and refuse to break below this it means it will be going up and the movement to upward side 
it might bounce uh, it might uh, you know break this particular formal support here and move back upward so let's play this and see what happens you see that guys keep watch you see what i'm saying you see what i just said now i believe you are seeing what i'm saying that is the movement of the market guys you see that first of all it has taken a profit here it has taken a profit here you see this you see you see that you see that guys you see what is going on that is what i am saying you see what is going on guys you see what is going on so that is exactly what i am talking about if you know how to do this properly that is when indicators uh, uh indicators strategies and all that is going to work for you all right if you know how to plot all these um all these uh trend lines and all this support and resistance on your chart that is when indicators are going to work for you without that is no way like get forward it's no way to work you there's no way those best strategies so far in the world is going to work for you if you don't know how to analyze your chart properly if you don't know how to you know um check for the structure of the market and know where the market is heading to in the next few minutes or in the next one hour in the next four hours there is no way those indicators are going to work for you it can only work for you if you knows how to um, analyze your chart this way that is why you see that most of us that are trading we are hardly um or most of us that are trading hardly lose money because we actually um know how to analyze this chart this way and if you know how to analyze your chart without indicators once you apply indicator once you install any indicator on your chart those indicators will be like an assistant to you it will be um helping you to reconfirm that what you analyze is very very right so that is it guys and uh, as i said earlier on if you are getting much value from this uh whenever you upload like this youtube will um let you know that home of good content or home of all good content has uploaded another powerful content that will um help you progress and um uh, reach your destination in trading all right so with that being said guys and uh, also also one thing that you really need to do if you want to add indicator this is where you're going to add indicator all right so um if you look at this particular chart i have some indicators installed on this chart all right but i am not using it that is why um that is why i uh, make made make it uh, that is why i made it uh invisible here you can see i can put this the same way make it visible make it visible here you can see that so when you look at all these indicators that you are seeing here all these two indicators that are added just now you will see that those two indicators are correlating with what i was talking about all right so as soon as this crossover happened what happened because it has broken this trend line this our initial trend line here that is when this downtrend started you see what is going on here so each of the zones that are marked the market whenever the market gets to that zone you do react to those zones so that is what you really need to do in any time frame that you are planning to trade with all right so don't make sure you analyze your chart starting from higher time frame and break it down to the minimum so that you'll be able to get the best out of your chart and the best out of your a trade all right you need to plan your trade before opening it all right so that is how it works